What's up everybody, Powerhouse WRX here with my boy Ian. Um, today we're going to be doing some retrofits on his, uh, what year is your car? 2017 STI. On a 2017 STI. So we're going to be doing a lot of uh, retrofits including LED uh, prisms, uh, new seat lights, and also new lenses. So stay tuned for the video on everything that we're doing. Alright, now that we dremeled out the hole for the wiring on the sea lights, um, it's just a matter of fitting everything through, lining it up, and then putting the covers back on. Uh, this is a little bit different from the one that we did earlier, because that was on a WRX. This one is actually on an STI. Um, so, these sea lights are actually, um, didn't say this in the beginning of the video, but these sea lights are actually going to be sequential. Um, so they could act as turn signals, they could add as day, daytime running lights, they could do all sorts of different color schemes that um, our boy here decides to do with it. So now it's just time, like I said, to put everything together and see what happens with these. Stay tuned. <laughs> Another mod that we're going to do with these headlights on the STI are these um, etched um, lenses from um, the Circuit Demon. Uh, it's a little bit different, unique look from just the standard uh, clear lenses that you get on the car. Um, Circuit Demon has different versions of this. You could get them custom etched with your own design, or you could just look at getting something like this, a honeycomb shape. Um, the installation on this is really simple. All you have really is these two screws right here um, That's actually holding the silver um, Frame on that once you unscrew that take the old lens out set the new frame on tighten it down and then you're good to go uh, The next step on this after we've done this part is we're going to reinstall everything here and then we're going to look at the um, Profile prism hex halos, right? So they're a little bit different from the ones that we've done before but they're going to somewhat sit around here somehow. We haven't figured out where we're going to position it. But these are going to add a different and unique look to the STI lights once we get it all set up and squared away. Um, so let's figure out where we're drilling this and how we're tying it down. And we'll be back. All right, everybody. So we're back. The lights are put back together and everything is assembled and installed. As you can see... C lights are on, halos are on, and you can't really tell, but the uh, lenses on this thing with a honeycomb looks really sweet. Um, a lot of the wiring was done um, right back here. If you can see this, all behind here are all your wires, the control modules and everything else that we routed back here. So that way, when your bumper's on, you don't really see much of anything. Uh, when you're wiring this up, just a little tip for your turn signals. Um, to if your sea lights are uh, switchbacks or if you're going to use them as turn signals or if you're going to use your um, angel eyes as turn signals as well um, it's a quick tap into the blue down here which is part of the harness for your uh, turn signals on your bumper and um, part of the harness for your fog lights so a t-tap on the blue wire will turn your lights into turn signals um, and uh, we're going to have a little quick look at what everything looks like um, here in a second. So here's what it looks like as a sea lights as the uh, turn signals. It's a sequential turn signal, so you get this nice effect, this running effect when it's on. Um, but when we turn it on and off, these sea lights have a really unique kind of start and off uh, sequence that it goes through. Go ahead and turn it off. 
So here's it on and it goes off and back on. It's a really cool little way to, that this thing works. So here's the setup. Here's the final setup on the STI. Again, this was a 2017 STI. Um, if you got any questions about the wiring or the hookups, go back to my previous video when we did the 2015 WRX. Very similar install, very similar wiring. It's just a whole different effect. Thanks for watching, guys.